vlog. We are at the moment headed to Uluwatuese. We're gonna explore all the fantastic beaches. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna explain and show why Uluwatu is one of the top destinations in Bali. And also we booked a beautiful place mm -hmm. in Uluwatu. We're Cannot gonna, wait. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do a little tour there as well. Yeah. So you guys know uh, what to expect when you go to Uluwatu. It's gonna be a lot of fun guys. Come and yeah. join us today. Stay with us. Here we are guys, arrived to the villa I mentioned, it's called La Bambu Bali. Guys, no luck, unfortunately. Uh, the worst scenario happened and we arrived without the booking and we checked if they've got uh, two available rooms. Unfortunately, <laughs> then only have a one. It's with the two bed, but upstairs bed is basically- Opened It's air. opened, yeah, open air. So probably at night bugs would eat us. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna carry on. Why don't you ask if I'm ready for this? I can't not believe. Is this the way to reception, is it? <laughs> Jesus, okay. Guys, these are the rooms. <laughs> Guys, we just found out there is another hotel. So if this one doesn't work, we try this one. So guys, this is uh, Nita, right? Hi. And this lovely lady will show us the room, so let's have a look. Let's go in. Uh, looks really good, actually. I must say it looks really good. I like this little table next to the bed. And just have a look at the view. That is incredible. And there is a bathroom. Yeah. So basically, there is another room yeah. on the bottom. And yeah, view is amazing. We're gonna check on the price and we're gonna keep you updated, guys. Right, we decided we're gonna check on the Dream Sea as well. I'm really looking forward to see this one as well. So guys, this is a Dream Sea hotel, which is neighbor with the Lake Cliff. I already must say, I like this room a little, little more. Uh, it seems really, really cool. Uh, very similar view, as I said. It does have a balcony as well. So overall, very similar hotels, but I like this one more. It looks fresher, it looks newer. I know, guys, I said I like uh, Dream Sea a little bit more, but Le Cliff came with unbeatable offer <laughs> and they gave us basically way better price than the Dream Sea was. So <laughs> let's have a look together. This is our balcony, it's pretty spacious. I would say, I would really say. Bigger than the room. It is size of the room, so really a lot of space here. We're gonna hang out over here and this table, chairs, Alina, and look at the view. Unbelievable. And welcome, we arrived we to made it. <laughs> Niang Niang Beach, apparently wonderful beach and uh, it already seems like mm. something absolutely out of this world. Oh, White yeah. sand, oh, beautiful God. beach and we're gonna check it out. Let's go and test the sand first. Nice, powdery, powdery, <laughs> powdery, powdery. <laughs> sugary. <laughs> Experience true 
beautiful sandy beach make sure you head to Uluwatu in the area where we live in Changu there are more, more black sand beaches uh, this is surfers paradise yeah. and uh, one of the most beautiful areas we Guys, so uh, Dreamland Beach is basically situated just uh, north from a famous Padang Padang Beach or generally on a more northern part of the Uluwatu. Uh, so far we really like the beach because it is a good combination of a uh, bit of wildness I'd say. Yeah. And uh, water seems really cool, really cool color, nice and blue. I so think it's good for swimming when the waves are not so crazy. Yeah. And when the waves are crazy, it's fantastic for a surfing. Yeah. Let's have a look at the wave now. And over there in the distance, but uh, water is nice and blue. And mm -hmm. if we check the sand, it's almost it's almost powdery. So really nice, really cool sand. Very similar to Niang Niang Beach. Yeah, very soft. Access to the beach is pretty simple. You just get off the main road and you just drive about two to three minutes down wow. the beach uh, there are signs as well and it's pretty simple parking is very accessible is right at the beach and also you do have a couple of restaurants over here guys and we are headed to padang padang there is the entrance there is a car park and this is the main road we arrived from that side went up to the car park and this is very famous beach padang padang is very well known for a surfing from a surfing scene and overall it's probably the most famous uh, Uluwatu beach so let's have a look together guys and here we are famous Padang Padang beach it's a small cozy beach uh, right in the center of Uluwatu we had to walk downstairs a uh, couple of monkeys they were just chilling uh, these ones were very friendly but some monkeys are not so friendly so make sure you keep an eye on them I was and afraid. Never, never hold anything in your hands and never show your teeth to the monkey because they might get aggressive yeah they think you, uh, they think you are uh, pulling your teeth because you are aggressive towards them it's fight. animal instinct let's just have a quick walk and see how does it look around So what do you think about this place? Uh, I prefer it more. You prefer than, it more yeah. over that one? Yeah. I think I do as well because uh, it's very cozy. Surfers are jumping into the water. The water is more calm here and sand is much more soft. Yeah. And in general it's much more clean. Like sand is way softer. Uh, maybe it doesn't look like on the camera but it's so 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 soft. So it's very cool yeah so overall score i would say really high but the only concern i have is it's quite a small beach so in a it prime season crowded, yeah. it will get crowded mm -hmm. for sure so yeah. uh, that's the only concern but besides that it's a super cozy little beach with amazing sand you do have some cafes and so on and a very bustling surf scene so you definitely will not get bored on this it's a climbing tons of stairs Particularly to Padang Padang Beach, it's one way down, one way up, it's a lot of search. But we are almost there, heading to our scooter and getting to another place. So first impressions guys, it's extremely difficult to get here. So those who are driving a scooter or driving a car, be careful and make sure you drive very slowly and uh, because the road is absolutely terrible basically there is no road uh, for access this beach gets probably one out of ten uh, you also will have to climb quite a lot of stairs but we are heading there and that looks like absolutely beautiful place This beach is called 
Thomas. It's about five minute drive from Padan Padan down the south, uh, very close. Um, it's absolutely amazing place. What do you think about beach? It's pretty wild. These stairs are absolute killer. Killers, but it's worth it. Yeah. That's gonna be beach number four. It's called Green Ball Beach. I was personally looking forward to this. How about you? Yeah, me too. who are selling bintang here not too many people yeah. and also surfers are coming uh, right over there behind those people so if you check those waves they are perfect for surfing for any surfer enthusiast this is gonna be your heaven it's gonna be some music very soon I've got a feeling <laughs> so it's great yeah guys if you enjoyed today's video give us a big thumbs up please and don't so don't forget to subscribe please let us know in the comments which beach did you like the most yes please we will definitely respond to that anyways guys thank you very much for uh, watching we will see you in the next video stay tuned we're gonna bring a lot of exciting content see you see you soon guys